Hi guys, welcome back. Um, today, I'm going to be working on this seat. It's a, it's from a Rover P6 originally, but apparently it's a genuine Ron Arid chair. Whether it is or not, I don't know, but the customer says, or the owner of the seat says, it's a genuine Ron Arid, and there's one for sale on eBay at the minute for nearly £8,000. Whether it's worth £8,000, I've got no idea. But it's not really usable at the minute. So the owner wants this chair to be, to be able to be used. He has another one, so he's got a pair of these. Um, so I'll do this one first, and if this all works out, he'll bring the other one in, and I'll do the other one. So I'm going to take this apart first. Let's see how this goes. See if I can take it apart without creating any more damage to it. So I'll take these bits off first. I'm not sure if it will make any difference. I'll see what's behind here. No, it shouldn't make any difference, so I'll take this off for now. So these are just held on. These metal tangs they sometimes are a bit brittle so I'll be very gentle with them I don't want to snap them all off so it looks like the form underneath is absolutely Yeah, yeah, I expect all this form to kind of disintegrate on me, but we'll see. I'm trying to be as gentle as I can with this. I'm as gentle as I can be. As you can see, I've got lots of bits falling out, which was expected. As you can see, um, it's it could be worse. It could be worse. I've seen I've seen them fall apart completely, but this is it's not in a great state, but it's not in the worst I've ever seen. I'm going to gently try and just remove the cover. So it's actually glued onto the form. So I'm gonna to have to try and gently remove it. Without damaging the form too much.
But this is going to take a while just to get this off without creating too much damage. I want to keep as much of this form as I can. As you can see, it's actually eluding quite a lot of it. I'm just going to tease it away as gently as I can. This is going to take a while. I need to unpick this. I'm going to unpick this centre panel because I need to restitch most of these. Well, not most of them, but I probably will restitch most of them. So I'm going to start at this end and just unpick this seam here. So it joins up as well I can expect. So I need to strengthen that now with a bit of leather on the back of it. So I'm now ready to sew all these pieces together on the, the centre panel. So before I start sewing this, can you just do me a quick favour and just hit that subscribe button? It would really help me out. Um, thanks a lot. Now I'll get on with sewing these.
so the seat's now finished and ready to be picked up by the customer. I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, give it a little thumbs up. Please subscribe and I hope to see you again. Thanks for watching.